5. Flames lit up the sky in Pinedale early this morning as firefighters were to contain a blaze at two apartment buildings near Herndon and Ingram. Investigators don't know how it started, but they say more fires like this one are possible as the temperatures drop and people look for ways to keep warm. And thanks for joining us tonight for Action News Live at 5. Good evening, I'm Warren Armstrong. And I'm Graciela Moreno. We have team coverage on the cooler weather. Kevin is tracking a series of cold storms headed our way that could be rain and snow. Let's begin now with Action News reporter Tiffany Olin. She's live in Pinedale with what may be contributing, a contributing factor to a growing number of fires and how you can protect your home and property. Tiffany. Yeah, Warren, that fire that you just mentioned happened right behind me. You can see what's left of what was two apartment buildings that set fire early this morning. Crews actually had to work from the outside because of how intense that fire was. An early morning fire has destroyed two apartment buildings in Pinedale. Flames broke out just after one Wednesday morning on Beechwood and College Avenues. The two buildings were fenced off and under construction, so no one should have been inside. The cause remains under investigation. On average, the city of Fresno, we respond to about a thousand structure fires a year. Statistically, that's just the data from over the last 10 years looking at those numbers. And on average of those thousand, roughly 10% are occur in vacant structures. Action News spoke to the property manager of the apartment buildings. She didn't want to go on camera, but told us she's frustrated. She says the property was vacant for about a week while crews were working on other projects. She added there had been homeless people on the property several times. According to Fresno Fire, half of the vacant structure fires in the city are due to homeless activity. You might imagine that uh, you see more of it during the colder seasons as the temperatures drop and folks are looking to stay warm, that uh, that may be a contributing factor, but uh, the numbers, it just seems to be throughout the year. The city of Fresno does open four warming shelters throughout the city from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. when temperatures drop below 35 degrees. Cots and blankets are provided to those inside. As for preventing fires, Fresno Fire says there are precautions property owners can take to avoid possible future fires like the one in Pinedale. Property owners and neighbors just encourage everyone to be vigilant and uh, maintain the property. Um, you want to make sure that it's secure so that folks can't uh, easily gain access to it uh, and keep an eye on it. Um, if you start to see activity, you want to report that. And luckily, no one was hurt in the fire that happened this morning and this afternoon. Those buildings were demolished. Live in Pinedale, Tiffany Olin, ABC 30 Action News.